Nick, we finally made it here. <laughs> finally. Um, after all the setbacks and detours we've made to get here, I'm so elated to be here with you and those who have supported us throughout our journey. What you mean to me cannot be described in just a few words, not just because English is not my first language, but um, I, I feel like it's only appropriate to describe it in my own way. You are my missing puzzle piece, or shall I say, my better half. <laughs> that has allowed me to dream big and be my most authentic self no matter what. Not only that, you are the captain to my co-pilot. As we move forward onto our new chapter and with you as my husband, I vow to make you happy with the little things, to make you laugh until you get the hiccups, to cherish you like a precious container, and to always be there for you no matter what. I love you. Evelyn. I'm convinced that no combination of words can fully encompass what you mean to me. But I know you like it when I try. So here's my feeble attempt. Your beauty is captivating. Your heart is made of gold. And your comedic genius is surpassed by none. I dedicate the rest of my life to you and this marriage. I'll never give up. I'll never run away. I'll always trust you. I'll always take care of you. I'll always listen. I'll always comfort you. I'll always be grateful for how lucky we were to find each other. We will face every stage of life, every adventure, every trial and tribulation side by side. I love you, Evelyn, and I'm so grateful and proud to call you my wife. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss your bride. <laughs> Family and friends, it is my honor and privilege to introduce for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Buck. So yeah, I just I was told to be the MC of the evening, and thank you guys for being here. Um, there is a couple of uh, public service announcements, please. Ladies and gentlemen, how about, let's hear for Mr. and Mrs. Buck. This is Mrs. Buck. Congratulations. I've known Nick and Evelyn for, I've known Nick for seven years, and uh, Evelyn for six of those, which is probably the better part of the six of the seven. And so, uh, I gotta say, like, over the years, I've learned to love both of them, and... But obscure facts aside, uh, one thing's remained constant, and that's how much I've seen that they care for each other. And I've seen it every day, whether they're prepping meals for each other, visiting each other at work, uh, caring for each other when they're sick, even if that means sleeping on the worst couch in existence. They say that you don't marry the person you can live with, you marry the person you can't live without. And that sums up Nick and Evelyn perfectly. So I'd like to raise a glass for a toast to the new Mr. and Mrs. Buck.